Can we lose some rounds here? Oh, we're gonna get away, but. Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome, welcome to Evil Noodle Gaming. Welcome back to Coastal Life Department of Justice Roleplay. Hope you're all doing well and enjoying the videos so far. I can't thank you enough for the support that you've brought to the channel um, over the weeks, the months, the years. It's been incredible. I cannot thank you enough. I really do hope that you are enjoying the content. Anyway, today we're going to be doing some criminal activity. Uh, I would like to quickly say, if you'd like to be a part of the Coastal Life Department of Justice roleplay community, the link is in the description, just down below. Uh, it's all there, the website, it takes you directly to the website. Go ahead, click on it and apply. If you like the fun roleplay, the serious roleplay, this really is the community for you. Anyway, we're going to be out today, we're going to be picking up some mysterious parcels uh, our boss has told us to go to some you know, locations around coastal coastal county and uh, we're gonna be picking up unknown items from these people's houses we've got a vehicle it's gonna be it's gonna be a stolen vehicle uh, it's been given to us uh, we've put on some false plates just called rent me should be able to see that just to try and pretend that it's a rental van. I don't know whether it's going to work or not because it's not going to come back to anyone, to be honest. So, that'd be interesting if we do get stopped, uh, how we can go and get away with that one. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to be picking up some mystery items from people's houses. We don't know what's in them. They're obviously not going to be kosher. So, we're going to have to try and roleplay that out as much as we can. And uh, once we've gone round, picked up all the parcels, we gotta uh, drop them off at a, uh, a location. I believe so. Is I believe it's behind the yellow jack. I believe that's where we need to leave the van, and it's gonna be picked up by someone else, or they're gonna pop the items into a different vehicle, most likely. Uh, let's head on out then. Our first pickup's literally around the corner here. Uh, we've got it jotted down on a little tiny I was going to say we've got it on a piece of paper but let's just say we've got it written down on our arm so we can quickly like rub the information off I guess just in case we get stopped so the first pickup is going to be around the corner here gonna be I think it's this house here actually yeah this looks like it okay so we go ahead and uh, get the uh, door open okie doke okay Arrives at first uh, pickup point. Uh, let's put list list of pick uh, list of pickups is uh, do, 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 written on my arm okay arrives at first pickup point list of pickups is written on my arm and collects first unknown ah damn it item okay so let's go ahead and oh we forgot to pick the item up there. Let's go ahead and pick it up. 
There we go. Okay. Right, first item was in the back of the van here. Let's go ahead and close this door. Lovely stuff. Okay, let's pop into the chat. Okay, first item. First item picked up. Okie doke. Right, let's go to our next location. Now we've got several of these to do. Not too sure what that guy was beeping then. Pretty sure I was on my side of the road. There we go. Should be able to make it past this van. Just. Okay, we've got another item to pick up here. Plenty of people <laughs> want an unknown items to be picked up. Here we are. Lovely stuff. Let's pop in. Get the doors opened. Okie doke. It's going to be just here on the floor. There we go. Okay, so we got a second item. And let's go ahead and pop this into the van. Lovely. And we get the door closed up again. Okay, so second item picked up. I keep missing out words when I'm typing in the chat. Second item picked. There we go. That'll be fine. I'm sure they'll understand. <laughs> I'm not the brightest of people when it comes to uh, spending out things and pushing the enter button before we uh, go ahead and finish. Oh, we uh, hit the bottom of our van there. Okay, should be alright doing a few overtakes here. Oh, it's going to be close. Just made that. I don't want to get stopped with these unknown items on me i mean i make a fair bit of money out of doing this so that's why we do it as a career i say career it's a bit of a risky career because to be honest we're not a bad person <laughs> we're not a bad person indeed That's kind of what it is. It looks similar-ish with the limitations of what we're allowed to use in the game uh, to like what you would hire out as a rental vehicle, which is kind of why I went for the whole rental idea, especially putting rent me on the back. I kind of like that little touch there. Okay, so we've got a swing of left here. We've got a second pickup. Literally just to our right. It's going to be around the back here. Uh, possibly going to be best to reverse into there. There we go. Okie doke. Let's get the door open again. And we get the item picked up. Lovely stuff. Okay. Oh, it's a heavy one. <laughs> oh, my back. Okay. That's the third item picked up. So we're going pretty well here. Not had any um, activity so far. Okay. Uh, so we're popping third item third item picked up okay so the next one's a little bit further down the road gonna be getting slightly closer to 
more heavier police activity down this way. Farmer's left his tractor in the middle of the rows. He's terrible for doing that. <laughs> that. That's really thoughtless of him. Actually, I think there was a vehicle there yesterday. Pretty much the same location. So the next, we've got a, quite a few pickups in this location here. Uh, so I'm just wondering which way is the best way to do it. Possibly if we start at this little cabin on our left here. Let's get reversed into here. Lovely. Okay, oh, I'll tell you what I forgot to do. I forgot to open up the uh, doors here. Lovely. Okay, so let's go ahead and pick up the third item. It's going to be around... Uh, oh, no, there it is. He's left it in the garage for us. That's fine. It's in the corner here. There we go. Oh, it's another heavy one. God, I'd like to know what's in these. Okay. So that is the fourth item in the back of the van. Uh, let's pick. Let's let's just say uh, fourth item. Fourth item picked up. Uh, noticed. Uh, what can we say? This noticed white powder uh, around the okay so we kind of up the ante a little bit here uh, let's go ahead and get the doors closed again a little bit annoying this but it's got to be done it's got to be done for realism <laughs> okay Just trying to remember where my next pickup is. I think it's down here, to be honest. Mm, no, it's not that house. Ah, oh, yeah, that's it. It's going to be the one with the flag, so we're going to need to loop back round again. Okay, we we'll do a left here quickly. Another quick lift. Yeah, here we are. Okay, let's go ahead and once again get the doors open. I guess what we could do, we could just put door three into the chat and then it opens it up each time, I guess. Let's go ahead and quickly pick up this parcel. I believe it's written down that's going to be behind this green car there it is okay lovely right lovely okay we got the other box here no one about so far let's put the box in to the van uh, yeah, we should be able to do, uh, let's put into the, I think if we do door three, yeah, there we go. Okay, so we can do that each time now. Fifth item picked up. Uh, what can we notice on this item? Uh, let's put notice that there are that there are 
Uh, what can we put? Most of there are many. Uh, fake. Oh, uh, he's put. Most of there are many fake DVDs in box as it was st still open. Okay. So that's the fifth item picked up. Got a bit of a drive now to the next one. It's going to be down near the uh, motel area. I'm thinking if we pop into the chat. If we pop into the chat that someone rings no, I don't know I don't know about doing that I, I was thinking about putting into the chat that someone rings up to say that they're a bit miffed as to why I don't know they're a bit suspicious that a weird van picked up weird items for my house got another pickup from behind here Uh, where is it? Oh, okay, it's going to be down here. Okay. So we go ahead and pick up the other item. Let's get the door open first. I believe if we do... Yeah, there we go. Door through. Okay. Let's go ahead and pick up another box here. It's going to be... Uh, apparently it's at the top up here. There we go. Okay. Got the other box. Oh, you're delivering it. Yeah, working hard, working hard. Uh, uh, I was thinking some guy who was thinking again to trespass and basically. Nah, we're allowed Richard. to do this type of thing. Oh, I didn't think we were going to get away with that. <laughs> I can't believe we got away with that. Okay, so uh, let's put sixth item picked up. I didn't think we'd get away with that, to be honest. Now we've got one more item to pick up around here. I thought he might have questioned me a bit more maybe. I mean, I don't look like your typical parcel man. Well, I don't know. I mean, no, because normally they would wear a uniform. And obviously we're not wearing a uniform. We're in an unmarked vehicle. It doesn't have any company liveries on it. Okay, yeah, got another item back here. It's going to be just behind here. Yeah, I don't know. I think... I think we're really lucky on that, to be honest. Okay. It's going to be with these boxes here. Uh, oh, no, here it is. Okay, so it's in the corner down here. Let's go ahead and pick this last box up from this area. And we've got a couple that are going to be pretty close to the police station, unfortunately. Uh, but we should be okay. Okay. Uh, 
gonna need to pop into the chat there we go door number three has been closed uh just wondered how we could advance this slightly okay i'll tell you what we could do uh let's put seventh item now picked up van is looking uh the fan is looking overweight there we go Everything. so we've got one more pickup to do it's going to be near the police station it's going to be where the hospital is someone that we've got that works there I believe it's going to be lending us some medicines that fed on the floor <laughs> <laughs> originally from the back of a lorry I'll tell you what I think we're going to get away with this Let's swing a left here then. I'm thinking we possibly stop. We we'll stop at the front of the hospital here. Uh, let's do it. Yeah, yeah. Let's stop outside the front here. Looks nice and quiet. Uh, that would be fine. Let's make sure the van's locked. I don't know. Oh, I'd say that. Can we now not open the door? Oh, we can. Okay, that's fine. Okay, now a friend did say that the item is going to be around here somewhere. Well, that's more the police station, so maybe they did leave it around the back. It's definitely around... I don't think they're going to risk leaving it outside the front. Uh, okay, so I've left it in the bush here. That's fine. It's just going to be down here. Right, let's go ahead and pick up this last box that we've got to pick up here. There we go. Oh, there's another heavy one. Lots of medical supplies in this one. Let's go ahead and pop into the back of our van. Honestly, I think we are going to get away with this. Uh, let's quickly put down the box. Lovely. No, uh, door three. Okay. Okay. So we we'll pop in last item now. Uh, we we'll put up. We we'll put in last item now picked up from. Hospital. Hey. In. Uh. Hey. Hidden in the bush. Hey. Outside. Yeah, what's up, buddy? No. <laughs> uh. Now. Heads in over let's put now heads in overweight van to uh drop off point if 
from the hospital okay so we're just put into the chat now heads in overweight van to drop off point from the hospital so we've made it pretty obvious there how well geared up are they <laughs> We're going to have to go pretty slow because the van's pretty well weighted here. It doesn't hold particularly many boxes, this van. It's uh, it's pretty rubbish, to be honest, at deliveries. If you're watching on your mobile phone right now, as it's gone dark, you may need to increase the brightness. Damn, this van is slow. We're going to have to get some fuel quickly. Because if not, we're not going to make it back home either. So let's... Uh, let's do that. Okay, let's put in... Stops... Off to... Fuel up van okay so we we're gonna allow some extra time here hopefully we can get fueled up and to the drop off point let's put unknown items in van will soon be dropped off at uh at we'll soon be dropped off let's put behind the bar Yeah, all right, hey, all man. right. Hang on. What's the matter you with you? Buy, you want to buy some of the goods? Hey, move on. What do you want? Do you want me? Do you want me to chat to, you or do you want me to move up and get out? I'm your wondering way? if you want to buy some good stuff. I got the latest stuff going. Well, it depends what you mean by good stuff. I mean, I'll be Come talking. Come to the car. Come to the back. I'll show you. Well, I got to drop off this vehicle, my friends. What type of good stuff are we talking about here? You see, no more bad. I really can't afford to hang about long because I've got right. quite a few items in the back of that van that I don't need to be there to be honest. I didn't understand a word. I didn't understand a word of that. I got Blu-ray. Got DVD. I'm still in all the latest movies. Pirated. Well, what you got then? I don't know. What are you looking for? Well, you haven't seen it. Something. I, I'm into my really boring films, to be honest. Like what? <laughs> I got a load of films. Something that involves no action, no talking, it's in black and white, and it's got subtitles. <laughs> mm. Let me look. I thought, how can that be no talking then? Just go fucking look at a piece of paper, Danny. You don't want to see a movie and waste my time. I'm going to choose to not bother looking any longer. Yeah. Damn, that was a mistake. Uh, we're going to leave him to that. Let's go ahead and indicate here. Now, we did put into the chat... Oh, he's lit him up instead. He's a silly Billy. No, did we get away with that? Hey, man. Fuck you hey, doing, you stupid bro? Eh? Oh, I've gone past the like, pickup point. I need to borrow this, man. You think I can, please? Won't be for too long. I don't know how you think I'm meant to hear, hear you from your car when I'm in the mine. Hey, 
Hey, listen to me, motherfucker. I need the bar. You, you go vent your own fucking van out. <laughs> so we need to drop the items off at the back of this place here. Hey, motherfucker. Oh, let me the borrow that van, alright? What the hell are you doing? It's a red tool. Go and hey, get your own van, you no, fucker. No, 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 don't worry about it. Motherfucker. Get out the fucking van. Let me borrow it, man. I'll just give you some cash. You know, uh, just. Stop crashing out, into it, you prank. Please. I gotta pay for that. I got one more drop off to make back here, and then that's it. And then I can borrow it, right? Y yes, you can have it as okay. much as you want. Really? Amazing. Alright. Motherfucker. <laughs> if I leave it just here, <laughs> I'm gonna get in. Fucking dumb fuck. What's your drop off, mate? <laughs> right. Uh, let's go ahead and get this door open here. And I think we've got to leave the boxes in, at the back. Hey, I got lots of stuff to, to drop off, but you don't want to be driving this vehicle, trust me, not with what's inside of it. What's inside, man? Well, I don't know. I mean, it's all mystery items that I've had to pick up through the day, so, you know. What? Are they worth a lot of money? All I've been told is to leave the van here, and that's it. If you want to fucking take it, that's up to you, but don't expect to be living this time tomorrow. What do you mean? You work with. But I, I, I just work by myself. I'm my own boss. But if I do something wrong, oh. then I get told off. So is there? There's a bunch of stuff inside this van, right? Don't know. Oh, you don't know. Uh, let's go ahead and let's switch the lights off. I'm gonna leave the van unlocked. Okay. Parks up van with unknown items inside leaves for uh leaves it to right, man. be picked up. What do you mean you want the keys? I don't have any keys. Give me the fucking keys, man. Where is, are they inside the vehicle? No. Nope. <laughs> Even though the engine's running. Motherfucker. So, let's put into the chat here. Guy... Uh, doesn't know that the van is... So, we put into the chat that the guy doesn't know that the van is stolen. Uh, we're gonna put in... Calls the... Calls the police to say a white van has... You said it, my man. Uh... Been stolen from the... Yellow Jack so. Pub uh, has l lots of items inside. Okay, so our van was stolen, and uh, we're just going back to the police station now. We had a phone call back from one of the officers. Uh, they wanted to know more about the van. I mean, this is a bit risky, but we kind of need that van back because it's got quite a bit of money in there. Come on. How's it going, sir? I'm well, I'm well. Uh, I had a phone call from one of the officers to say that um, they could chat to me about a van that's been stolen. 10 4, uh, that's me. Oh, that's yourself? Uh, I, I gave you a call. Well, thanks for getting back to me. Did you manage to find it? That's the most important um, thing. 
Not currently. That's why uh, I'm trying to speak to you, because uh, I'm trying to get a bit more information from the van. We can't locate with what we got right now. Ah. Okay. Uh, kind of need that back, because use it for work, and there's quite a bit of stuff in the back of that van that kind I of... I understand. Yeah. Uh, I don't really want to lose it, because... I get told off by my bosses, and it's not particularly nice when they tell us off. To be honest. Yeah, no, I understand. That, they... That's why I called you here. I want to, uh, I want to make sure we get a bolo out for it and everything. So as soon as it gets seen, uh, we can get your van back. They love to go well over the top, and I've had enough black eyes to want to deal with all of this crap again. So it needs to be found. To be honest gotta have that van back and everything that's inside of it yeah i understand um could you fill out this paper here with uh, all the information of the van and stuff well i can tell you i'm not particular. i don't really want to write anything down to be honest um i'd rather just tell you maybe you could write it down yourself okay uh, well give me just one second i'll grab the uh bolo stuff and we'll put a bolo out for it okay okay so I don't really want to be writing anything because it's all right. I don't want any links to right. it at all. Um, what other color than the was the van? You said it's a white van. Yeah, it's going to be white in color. It's a all bit right. of a small looking van. It, it only holds um, about a ton worth of weight inside. It's, it's not a big van. It's just um, your typical workman's delivery van, really. Uh, nothing special. All right. Um, where did you last see that van? At your property or? Uh, no, it was going to be at the Yellow Jack pub. That's, uh, I don't know, what, a mile down the road, something like that. It's uh, pretty popular in this area. I, I, I reckon you know about it. A uh, Yellow Jack? Yeah, I think that's what it's called. I think that's what it's called. Uh, yes, sir. The, the bar up there by the airfield? Uh, seems okay. Uh, right. Yeah, yeah, it's um, gonna be down near the airfield. All right, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Um, all right, well, just go ahead, give me the kind of best description you got of your car, and I'll try my best to locate it. Well, I mean, it's a. I don't know what more to say. It's your typical van. I don't. I mean, we have we go through quite a lot of vehicles quite a lot all the time to be honest i don't know where they get them all from they like like a workman yeah i mean uh, they're always doing bits and pieces to them um and normally they end up i don't know dumped on the side of the road on fire something like that i don't know why but that's i don't know I, they, they they say to me that's the most economical way of disposing of a vehicle that's no longer needed after something that we shouldn't have used it for <laughs> Um, all right, well, I'll put a bowler out for that, and like I said, as soon as we see your vehicle, we'll uh, try and get a hold of it, and as soon as we have it, we'll contact you. Well, I hope so. We'll I do you. hope so. Uh, the last place you saw it was Yellow Jack Bar, right? Uh, let's put Keeps Heads. And for 85, down. can I have you roll down there just to see? Yeah. Oh, sorry about that. All right, um... Well, like I said, I'll put it out, and I apologize for not having your van yet, but we are for sure having eyes for it. Well, I do hope you find it. You know, there's... Uh, I, ca I can't go through this again. I'm lucky to still be here, to be honest, uh, especially what, what happened to the last driver. I haven't seen him in months now, so, uh, yeah, I, I dread to think what happened to him. <laughs> I probably yeah, shouldn't um, even be here, to be honest. I probably should have just left it, but never mind. It's done now. Let's hope that you can find where the van is. Uh, I just really need it back because it's. It, uh, I'm in so much trouble if I don't get that van back. No, I understand. It's not like so said, much we'll, the van. Uh, we'll it's, just, best to get it. it's just the stuff that's inside of it. There's lots of work stuff in there. Well, that's what they tell me anyway. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> Alright, um, well, you're free to leave, and like I said, we'll give you a call as soon as we find it. That's great. I do hope you call me rather soon, and, uh, it, let us, if you find it, let us know where it is. I'll make my way to that location straight away. As soon as I get there, I'll get it out of your, get it out of your hands so you, you don't have to 
be concerned about it any further. Okay. All right. That's great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Right. Let's go ahead and leave now, then. <laughs> he just fell over. Uh, uh, so laggy inside of that police station. I really hate being inside of there, to be honest. Um, I'm not too sure if we're going to be able to push this any further. I've got an idea. Okay, so we had a call back from the police. They said that they, they found the van. They didn't really tell me any more information than that we're in a another one of our stolen vehicles here they said that they they did find the van now this is extremely risky you know involving the police when there's these types of items in the car in the van but i'm hoping that we could literally arrive and just take the vehicle that's what I'm hoping. Uh, let's just park the vehicle back here. Good, hey, how's it going? Thanks for finding it for us. Uh, is this the van? Uh, I don't know. I mean, it's white. It kind of looks like it. But it's one of those rent, rent, rentable vans. So it's got rent me at the back there. So... They could, uh, have, they could have lots of them. Asking. What was in the bag? Did you manage to see? Yeah, a lot of boxes. Boxes? Were you transporting boxes earlier? Well, I mean, doesn't have one nowadays that works in the parcel collection industry? Yeah, there were some DVDs in it. Oh, was it? I'm not allowed to look inside the boxes because obviously, you know, it's not very nice looking at people's personal belongings. Yeah. No, I mean we look through almost all of them, so D does it I know what's in there. Can I just put my head through the window? I mean, it... I mean you can peek through the window as much as you want, man. All the vans look the same, you see. So I don't want to say it's mine, and then it turns out not to be because I'll look a bit silly. That makes sense. I just need a confirmation on whose van this is. Is it possible to have a look inside the vehicle? Is it still open? Uh, no, I've locked all the doors. Not oh, currently, damn. you can't go inside currently. I mean, if I... If I could have keys. a look inside, I might be able to tell, because I, I sit in a certain way when I drive. I like to have my seat Well, I mean, I'll, 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 I'll knock the doors, but I can't give you the keys. Uh, well, that's okay, then. That's fine. Okay, well, uh, uh, the doors are unlocked. Just uh, don't try to take off nothing. Okay. So we did say that we could hot wire cars. What do you say? Is that it? Is that yours? Locks. Doors. And... Breaks the lock. What about, sir? But the door's locked now and the lock's broken. <laughs> well, cover your face. I'll bust the window. No, because it's a rental bloody van. Don't go doing that. Well, I don't really care. I'm grabbing my glow bar. You better cover your face. Well, let me crawl out the back then. I need to get rid of this stuff. Hot wires. Van. Oh, okay. We need to get rid of this stuff. It's gonna be the world's slowest pursuit. <laughs> we're off. We're going. We're going. We're going. We're going. Come on. We've got to get rid of this stuff. We've got to get it to the drop and off point here. Oh, I really shouldn't have made off. Not in this van. Oh, it's so slow. They use an unnecessary force. did not want a police chase. It's not keeping too dangerous here. Here's a van after all. I've got to find somewhere to go with this van. Somewhere that we can get away. 
Oh, that was so close. <laughs> we need to find a hiding spot here. Come on, we've got to find somewhere. There's got to be somewhere. It's got to be somewhere. It's just the one cop now. I don't want to be here for too long. More police officers are going to arrive. Oh, the heart's pounding. I tell you what, I reckon they're going to trash their own vehicles before they finally get me stopped. Come on, that's a big hit there. That's a big hit. I need to find somewhere to hide. This is no good. I tell you what, we're going to head over to the shacks. The, the little uh, houses over here. Got to find a hiding spot. Come on, that vehicle's got to be done for. Oh, is this nearly done in? No, it's gone. It's gone. We've got to go. Shit. This is it. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my God, the heart's pounding here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We've got a gap. We've got a gap. We've got a gap. Oh, we gotta get away here. Come on, there's gotta be so many places we can go. Just don't, don't bugger up here. We can cut around the side. No! Oh, no! That's close! We need to find a hiding place! Oh, shoot! It's gotta be somewhere we can go. Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, you it. No. Get away. Fuck. Oh, they're right behind us. Oh, they're catching up. <laughs> no, this is not good. No, oh, he's seen me. Ugh. Come on, we've got to go somewhere here. There's got to be somewhere. There's got to be somewhere we can go. Can we lose some bounds here? Oh, we're going to get away with it. Can we hide in a bush? Did we get away with this? Oh, please don't find me. Please don't find me. Oh, we got away with it. Please go away. Please go away. Please go away. <laughs> Alright, sir, we know we're in here. Put your fucking hands up right now. Go. Put your hands No! Hands up, you're gonna get shot. No! I'm gonna shoot you, man. Oh, damn it. I thought we got away with it. Shit. Come on. Ah, oh, damn it. I so thought we. No, he's got us. So that could have gone better. So why'd you run? Uh, we've been told to exercise once a day. <laughs> ah, so you decided to run from the cops of all things. Well, it's good to all join in the same activity now, then. Alright, right now you're going to be placed under arrest for uh, fleeing and invading, as well as you're going to get charged with whatever's in the van, which we'll figure out once we get it down to the station. But it's not my uh... van. Well, you were in possession of it. You allowed me to sit inside of it. What do you expect? Isn't that entrapment? <laughs> no, you, you, can't you, me, you can't let me go inside the vehicle and then say, oh, it's your van now. I mean, you confirmed it was your van and then uh, took off, so now it's your van. Well, you called us up, you said, we found a van, 
At no point mm -hmm. did I say to you, oh, this is my vehicle. Then I said, why'd you I take it? Yeah, and why'd you steal it? But why not? You gave you gave me the chance to to, to have a test drive in it. Oh, so you, I gave you, so I gave you, you a chance to take to look the look cocaine that was in the back? You found what? We found, yeah, there was cocaine in the back of that truck, sir. Well, it's not my vehicle, so I don't know what you're going to go. Oh, uh, okay. okay. Well, we'll see yeah, once we get out of the station. Yeah. Do you understand these rights that I've just read to you? I can neither confirm or deny no, I've understood those rights. Alright. <laughs> All right. Well, do you wish to speak to me any further? That's a no. <laughs> I can neither confirm or deny if I wish to speak to you any further. I feel really ill now and I've hurt my head. My head's really hurt and it's your duty of care to take me to the hospital and get that checked out. So you know, as soon as you're done here, you're going to be going to jail. You do understand that, right? I have the right to it, it neither confirm or deny that statement you just said. <laughs> that makes no sense. All right, sir. So, so I'm gonna place you here. All right. If you go anywhere, trust me, that'll be the worst thing you'll ever do. No, I'm not that type of person. I've had my day's exercise. Alright, so I'm gonna take these cuffs off you, alright? I'm no threat to you. So, go right here, and then lay down, the doctor will be right with you, alright? This bed looks more comfy. Alright, we'll go in that bed then. There's also t shoes with that bed. Uh, no, he, he looks nothing like me, so... <laughs> but we're gonna... We're gonna need to do this. Fines, uh... This bit, fines. Fines, uh, okay, fines some clothes on the side and changes into them. Okay. So we're going to pretend to be some sort of janitor now. But if we put leaves, close outside of the hospital room. Uh, leaves my clothes outside the hospital room. Okay. Don't know where the police are. I'm surprised he left me. I tell you what, there's a car here. Oh, it's open. I tell you what, we've got away with it. We have just got away with that. We have, we have definitely got away with it. How the hell did we get away with that? Gotta to go to our little hideout place here. So our character, they never asked me for my name. I wasn't gonna provide it to them. They're not gonna find anything that belongs to me in that van. Because all of our information was written on my arm. So, my character, Richard Richards, and if you watched a particular TV soap, sitcom, comedy, I guess, in the early 90s, you should know, you should know who that name belongs to, Richard Richards. I can't believe we got away with that. Um, let's just put... Uh, let's just put police. 
will find uh, that the suspect has uh, da -da -da -da, left the hospital he changed uh, da -da -da, his clothes and on a staff uh, uniform okay and out the door okay uh, so yeah, police will find that their suspect has left the hospital, he changed his clothes and put on the staff uniform and walked out the door. No info about me was left in the van. Plates are false. Uh, as well yeah there you go that's fine I can't I, okay I, I know our character looks different <laughs> um, yeah okay our character does look different now I admit but I probably should have tried it takes a hell of a lot it takes a long time trying to adjust your clothes unless you go for like a saved custom ped so uh, uh, a saved vanilla ped uh, but we're going to finish up now yes our character does look different but it was simply just so we could change the outfit so okay we made several pickups around the city uh, around the uh, the county yeah. There was a weird guy that tried taking my van off me. He did take the van, even though I parked it up. Oh, we were then silly enough to go to the police station and give them information about the van. We were then further silly about <laughs> going to the, the van and then trying to make off with it. I'm surprised, to be honest, that those police cars were able to continue chasing me after all that time. But never mind. Um... We then get taken to the hospital because I made up a injury. They never checked to see whether I was injured. So <laughs> we, get, we got left at the hospital with no protection. from any, we, we, we weren't guarded by any police officers. And we were able to just simply quickly find some clothes that were left on the side and just walk out. Anyway, we're going to finish up. Do hope you enjoyed the episode. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Give it a thumbs down if you didn't. Let us know what type of content uh, you would like to see from the channel regarding Coastal Life Department of Justice in the comments down below. Would you like to see more recorded videos? Would you like to see more streams? What types of recorded, recorded episode or streams would you like to see? Uh, whether it be like chaotic episodes, your, your typical police officer's day at work, uh, pulling over cars, domestic instances, lost lost children, stuff like you know, a typical day for a police officer. And or would you like to see things that involve just myself and one or two people? And it goes from like a simple, I don't know, uh, a simple dropping lit on the floor to finding out further information about the person then finding out something else and something else and it builds more and more to the story as we go along you know some of the stuff like that let us know in the comments down below what type of content you would like to see from the channel because uh, it all goes a long way to bring you the types of videos that you like to see but anyway let's finish up now thank you so kindly for watching i do hope you enjoyed and i'll catch you in the next one until then goodbye thank you